Remember, AI is a capability that can be applied. Mm. And, and um, uh, uh, don't, it's necessary to, to uh, have regulation for important technologies, um, but it's, it's also don't, don't, don't overreach to the point where some of the regulation ought to be um, done, uh, most of the regulation ought to be done at the applications. Right. The FAA, NHTSA, FDA, right. you name it, all, right? All of the different, all of the different uh, ecosystems that already regulate applications right. of technology right. now have to regulate the application of technology that is now infused with AI. Right. And so, and so I think, I think um, uh, 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 there's, don't, don't, don't misunderstand, don't overlook the overwhelming amount of regulation in the world right. that are going to have to be activated for AI. Mm -hmm. And don't rely on just one universal galactic, right. you know, AI council that's going <laughs> to possibly be able to do this. Because there's a reason why all of these different agencies were created. There was different, there's for a sure. reason why all these different uh, regulatory bodies were created. Um, we we'll go back to first principles again. I'd get in trouble by my partner, Bill Gurley, if I didn't go back to the open source point. Yeah. You guys launched a very important, very large, very capable open source model. Yeah. Um, Nemotron. Re re yeah. Recently. Yeah. Um, obviously, uh, Meta is making significant contributions to yeah. open source. I find when I read Twitter, you know, you have this kind of open versus closed, a lot of, mm -hmm. a lot of uh, chatter about it. Yeah. Um, how do you feel about open source, your own open source models, ability to keep up mm -hmm. with Frontier? Mm -hmm. That would be the first question. The second question would be, is that, you know, having that open source model and also having closed uh, source models, you know, that are powering commercial operations, is that what you see into the future? And do those two things, does that create the healthy tension for safety? Mm -hmm. um, open source versus closed source, is related to sa safety, but not only about safety. Yes. You know, and so, so for example, uh, there, there's absolutely nothing wrong with having closed source models that are that are the engines of an economic model, <laughs> exactly. necessary to sustain innovation. Right. Okay. Right. I, I celebrate that wholeheartedly. Right. Um, it is. It is. It is. I believe, uh, wrong-minded to be uh, closed versus open. Right. It should be closed and Plus open. open. Yeah, right. Because open is necessary for many industries to be activated. Right now, if we didn't have open source, how would all these different fields of science be able to activate, be activated on AI? Right. Right. right? Because they have to develop their own domain-specific AIs, and and they have to develop their own using open source models create domain-specific AIs. They're related not, again, not the same. Right. Just because you have an open source model doesn't mean you have an AI. And so you, you have to have that open source model to enable the creation of AIs. So financial services, healthcare, transportation, the list of industries, fields of science that has now been enabled as a result of open source, unbelievable. Are you seeing a lot of demand for your open source models? Our open source models, so first of all, yeah. uh, Llama downloads, right? Incredible. Obviously, yeah, Mark and the work that they, they've done, incredible, right. off the charts. Yes. And it completely activated and and um, uh, engaged every single industry, every single field of science. Right. Okay, it's terrific. Um, the reason why we did Nemotron was for uh, synthetic data generation. Mm -hmm. uh, it, intuitively, the idea that one AI would, would somehow sit there and loop and generate data to learn itself, it, it, sounds, it sounds brittle. And, yes. and um, uh, how many times you can go around that infinite loop, that loop, you know, questionable. However, uh, it's kind of, <laughs> my mental image is kind of like, like uh, you get a super smart person, put him into a, a, a padded room, close the door for about a month. You know, what, <laughs> what comes out is probably not, not a smarter person. And, and so, so, but the idea that you could have, have two or three people sit around mm -hmm. And we have, we have different AIs, right. we have different distributions right. of knowledge, mm -hmm. and we can go QA back and forth. Mm -hmm. All three of us can come out smarter. Right. And so the idea that you can have AI models exchanging, interacting, yes. going back mm -hmm. and forth, debating, mm -hmm. reinforcement wow. learning, synthetic data generation, for example, yeah. uh, kind of intuitively makes sense. suggests and makes yeah. sense, yeah. 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 And so our model, Nemotron 350B is, 340B is, is uh, the best model in the world for reward mm -hmm. systems. Mm -hmm. And so it is the best critique. 
Okay. Interesting. Yeah. And so, so, um, a uh, fantastic model for enhancing everybody else's model. So irrespective of how, how great somebody else's model is, right. I'd ha- have recommend using Nemo 340B right. to enhance and make it better. And we've already seen made Llama better, made uh, all the other models better. Well, we're coming to the end. Thank um, goodness. <laughs> <laughs> as somebody who delivered <laughs> DGX1 in 2016, That's- it's really been an incredible journey. Your journey is unlikely and incredible at the same time. Thank you. You survived. Like just surviving the early days was pretty extraordinary. You delivered the first DGX-1 in 2016. Mm -hmm. We had this Cambrian moment in 2022. Mm -hmm. And so I'm gonna ask you the question I often get answered, get asked, which is how long can you sustain what you're doing today. With 60 direct reports, Mm -hmm. you're everywhere. Mm. You're driving this revolution. Mm -hmm. Um, Are you having fun? And is there something else that you would rather be doing? Is this a question about the last hour and a half? (laughs) The answer is I had a great time. I had a great time. I couldn't imagine anything else I'd rather be doing. Uh, let's see. I think it's, I don't think it's right, uh, to leave the impression that, that our, our job Mm. is fun all the time. Right. My job isn't fun all the time, nor, nor do I expect it to be fun all the time. Was that ever an expectation (laughs) that it was fun all the time? Um, uh, I think it's important all the time. Yeah. I take, I don't take myself too seriously. I take the work very seriously. I take our responsibility very seriously. I take our contribution and our moment in time very seriously. Uh, Is that always fun? No. Yeah. But do I always love it? Yes. Yeah. Uh, Like all things, uh, you know, uh, whether it's it's family, friends, children, is it always fun? No. (laughs) Do we always love it? Absolutely, deeply. Mm -hmm. And so, so I, I think the, the, um, uh, how long can I do this? Uh, the, the, real, the real question is, how long can I be relevant? And that only matters, that, that piece of information, that question can only be answered with, how, how am I going to continue to learn? And I am a lot more optimistic today. I'm not saying this simply because of our topic today. I'm a lot more optimistic about my ability to stay relevant and continue to learn because of AI. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I use it. Every, I don't know, but I'm sure you guys do. <laughs> I use it literally every yeah, day. There's it. not one piece of research that I don't involve AI with. Yeah. There's not one question that I, even if I know the answer, I double check on yeah. it with AI. Yeah. And surprisingly, you know, yeah. the next two or three questions I ask it Aren't reveals it? Yeah. something I didn't know. That's right. You pick your topic. Right. You pick your topic. And, and I think that, that um, AI as a tutor, AI as an assistant, um, AI as a, you know, a, 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 a partner to brainstorm with, 